Today I'm going to be using this home sign that I got from Michaels. It's part of their 4th of July red, white, and blue collection. So I got it for 70% off of the $6.99 regular price. And I'm just going to remove this raised star. And it came off pretty easily with the screwdriver, but I'm also going to just sand off whatever was left. I'm then going to take the General Finishes gel stain. This is antique walnut and the gel stain is oil based. And I'm going to use a gen foam brush to apply it to the entire board. Now these foam brushes can just be found at your local hardware store. We like the gen brand because it is a better quality. You don't lose the foam in your project and they don't really fall apart on you. So you just want to apply it to the entire front and then we will take our paper towel and remove all the excess gel stain and just rub it in. And once it's fully rubbed in, we're just going to let it fully dry. I'm then going to take my Wise Owl Snow Owl paint and go on top of the gel stain. Now I'm looking to get like a distressed grungy look so if your gel stain is not fully dry it'll just make the snow owl discolor a little bit but that's okay that's kind of the look I was going for and then we want that to fully dry I'm gonna take my sandpaper you can use like a 220 grit and I'm going to just give it a nice sanding this will help take out any of the streaks but I'm also going to distress it I want that gel stain to pull through the snow owl And also, it was just easiest for me to paint over the home since it was raised, then try to avoid hitting it. So then I'm just going to take the blow dryer and just remove all that extra sanding dust. Now I'm going to take my Wise Owl Anchor. You can also use the Bowie. The Bowie is sold in our 2-ounce paint sample pack. And I'm just going to paint on top of the raised home. And now you can really paint this any color of your choice. You could pick something that represents your favorite hometown sport league or anything like that. And I just went through the entire word home with the anchor. And then I'm just going to set that aside to dry. I have these small wood laser cut letters and I scored these at my local dollar store. Whenever they put them out I literally buy the whole entire section because I love the size of them. But you can also find something similar right at Hobby Lobby. And I'm going to take out the letters that give us the saying, there's no place like. And then I'm going to paint all of them using the Wise Owl Anchor. And also you can spray paint these, it is a little easier but I did not have blue spray paint. And then I'm going to allow all the letters to fully dry. I'm going to take a pencil and just lightly make two curved lines on the left and right side of my home sign. And I have this Krylon Shortcuts paint pen. I found it at a hardware store and it's in the color red. And then I'm just going to trace over the two curved lines I made with my pencil. And I did go over it two times. It is better if you allow it to dry a little bit before you go back on top of it. And then I'm going to add my little lines across and this will represent the stitching of a baseball. Now I did not measure, I just kind of went by my eye and they do not have to be perfect. If you want a perfect line with them all the same size then you can take out a ruler and do that. And again I did go over it two times, it just kind of helped darken it up a little bit. I then went back to my letters once they were dry and then I placed them on my sign. 
And you can mess with these so that they lay whichever way you are happy with. And I decided to make a curve in the there's in place and then just put the know and like in a straight line. I take some Elmer's wood glue and a small paintbrush and I just paint the wood glue on the back of each letter and place it down. And then I'm just using a small wreath ring to just give me the curve and the there's in place. And then I'm just making a little apostrophe in the top. And there we go. Now we have this fun, there's no place like home, baseball sign. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can all be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com. And don't forget, you can also check out other tutorials on our webpage as well. Have a great day.